converts that output to performance, and it can take you from 0 to 60 in 9.8 seconds. While most Toyota products offer three driving modes of Eco, Normal, and Sport, the CT200H throws in a fourth option, the EV or all-electric power mode. In real-world driving, we found it was adequate for a short run to the store or mass transit stop, but not recommended for any lengthy commuting. We found the CT200H handles well and can deliver performance when asked, but considering it's a hybrid, don't plan on setting any time trial records with it. But this is a Lexus, so of course the options are the expected informed telematic system and navigation platform. The interior can be described as luxury basic, with a greater emphasis on function than form. Lexus is also offering an F-Sport package for the CT200H, which includes upgraded wheels, a different grille, and other cosmetic touches, but no changes in the power platform. Our conclusion? It's a Lexus for drivers who want the luxury nameplate with the social responsibility of a Prius. This is Greg Morrison. We want to know what you think, so email us. The address is bumper to bumper TV at cs.com.